A new warning tonight from the State Department for anyone traveling to Cancun, Playa del Carmen, or Los Cabos. Officials say violence in those areas is on the rise. And CBS 2's Tom Wade is live at LAX where he spoke with travelers. Tom. Yeah, Pat, Pat, travelers out here are not so worried at this point because news of this travel ban really hasn't spread that much. As you know, cartel violence is to blame for a lot of this. And as travelers sort of talk about this, they are taking precautions. Cell phone video shows people running for their lives after a gunman started shooting up a nightclub in Playa del Carmen last January. Five people were killed. An American woman was among the victims, Alejandra Villanueva. Her sister spoke out after her murder. She, she died quickly. Was it painful for her? Now, seven months after that shooting, the U.S. State Department has issued a new warning to travelers. The area of Playa del Carmen and Cancun has seen an increase in murders, targeted assassinations, and cartel turf battles. Travelers could be in danger, the warning says. Also included in the new warning, Los Cabos, another popular destination for U.S. travelers, and also the scene of recent deadly violence. Maybe I have to be a little more aware of the kids because here they are a lot more free to go everywhere. Yadira Macias travels to Mexico often and has family in some of the affected areas. She's aware of the uptick in violence but says she has not experienced any issues. We travel usually to Veracruz, to Acapulco. We have family there and we have never gone through anything. And another popular travel destination in Mexico that still remains on that list is Acapulco. In 2015, 60 bodies were found in an abandoned crematorium on the outskirts of that city. Reporting live in LAX, I'm Tom Waite. Back to you in the studio, Pat.